to the truth of the matter is when you're a handsome man working on becoming the best version of yourself it comes with highs and lows you will have women that play these games with you and if you've been watching the rest of my videos you can resonate with the things that i've been going through the first thing they will try to do is convince you that they're not like that now this is a safety net for them because they can clearly tell if you got them you can attract way better than them. I know if you've been with females, you've heard this all day. Oh, you do this with the rest of your hoes, huh? You say this to all your hoes, huh? As much as they are attracted to you, they will try to act like you can't get in their jaws at any moment. That's why if you're an attractive man, it's much harder because they will try to make you jump through all these hoops and hurdles just so they don't seem easy. And once you give it up to them, trust me, they are going to be attached because they know a man like you doesn't come around all the time. Especially if you give them an experience that they will never forget. Like I'm talking about, you give them flashbacks. Trust me, she's all yours, bro. Once you hit that bottom, she is all yours. So that's why this is one thing they'll try to do. They will just assume many things about you. When you look like you're a man who has something going for yourself, they will already have all different perspectives in their mind about you. They can clearly tell that you have options as a man who's working on yourself. They have to do all the makeup and wearing the filters and getting the BBLs and stuff. But when you're a man who can just wake up, put some soap and water on your face, put some water in your hair, it's much easier for you to be attractive and not look superficial. So this is one thing they will do with you. Another harsh reality is women look at you for your looks, bro. The first thing they see when they look at a man is their appearance, how he's built. When a woman sees you, she wants to know, is she capable of procreating with you? How your baby's gonna look, how their hair is going to look, how how is their child going to look if they have one with you? They don't just want a man who just got dirty fingernails, who looks rough, who just looks like he's not taking care of himself. It's just the truth. You might even question if women are more visual creatures than men because Women, they will look at a man who's attractive more for his looks than his personality. You can be a cool dude to yourself all the time, but if you give certain women your attention, they will just look at you as boring and categorize you with these other men out here that they've been dealing with because you're an attractive man. So if you give too much of yourself, if you give her too much attention and stuff, it will further drive her down. It's unfortunate, but this is just how most women think. When you're a handsome man, you don't even have to say much. Most of these women can't even hold eye contact with you when they know that you're a man who they are attracted to. Trust me, these women out here get nervous when there's a man who looks good in front of them, bro. I've had women who can't even hold eye contact with me and, tell, and try to like put their hands on me, like move like that. You feel me? They will try to move your face away just so you don't make their panties wet. Just so you don't get their drawers soaked. They will try to have you not look at them because they are nervous. You make them nervous as a handsome man. And they will even try to change you to be the perfect boyfriend for them. See, women, they get competition anxiety. When you are a man who looks good, they will try to change you to be the perfect fit for them. They will try to make art you, keep you from all other females because they know a man like you doesn't come around often. So they will try to do their best to keep you from leaving them and get anybody else. And the truth of the matter is they drop their personality standards when they see a man that they are attracted to. Why do you think most of these females out here are attracted to the bad boys? The boys that look mysterious, but they look good to them because their standards are dropped. When a female is attracted to a man, she doesn't have rules for him. He can break the rules. If she's really attracted, trust me, some toxic advice. You can even cheat and she will still take you back if you know how to play it. That's just some toxic advice, but it's just the truth. If you're a man that looks good, as long as you let them know what it is, they already know you're capable of having other options. But if you look good to them, they will do everything to try and keep you around them. You will also become a threat to other men. See, when a man sees that you're attractive and he's in a relationship, most women, they are comfortable with the man that they are with a relationship in. But trust me, if they saw a man who was more attractive to them, all that will fly out the window. Why do you think these females are so attracted to these celebrities? Like Bad Bunny, Drake, and all these people out here. Because their rules don't apply to them. Trust me, if they gave them a chance, these women would bend over backwards in front of their men. Just look at the All My Lake clip that just came out. <laughs> if you've seen it, bro, you can see what happens when a female is truly attracted to a man. Even if she has a boyfriend, it's just a harsh reality. This is why you have to do your best to become the best version of yourself because no matter what, it's just her turn to be with you and she can always find somebody else out there. But when you're a man who she just can't stand to be with, you're always going to be on her mind. Another thing, they will be intimidated by your appearance. Like I said, it will be hard for women to hold eye contact with you. 
they will get shy and start blushing and stuff when you look at them. They'll be like, what, what you looking at? I'm looking at you. They can't even hold eye contact with you when you look that good. Cause all they can think about is you pounding them out. All they can think about is you getting a draw soaked when you looking at them. And they just can't seem to just hold that eye contact with you when you look that good. Like trust me, most women out here aren't submissive by nature. But when they see a man that looks good to them, all that sexual tension will hit even harder. They will get more sexually aggressive towards a man that they want. Because once they are soaked in their drawers, trust me, they are ready for you. But they can't just make it seem easy. They can't just jump at you right away because they know that you're a man who can get options, bruh. It's just the truth. And plus, they fear rejection. Like I said, well, competition anxiety. When you're a man that looks good, it's so easy for you to get the next option. So sometimes they will try to self-sabotage just because they know that you can leave them at any moment and you won't even feel a thing. They'll just be like a memory to you. Most of these females that have been in your life, try and write them down and look at who's still in your life, bro. Trust me, you can't tell me most of these females didn't try to make it hard for you. And another thing is women hold handsome men to a higher standard. I don't know if Hollywood just got him brainwashed with these Disney movies or whatever, but when they see a man who has something going for himself, they will automatically assume that you have something financially going for you, bro. The truth of the matter is most of these men that they deal with on a daily basis are either bums or they are just average men who just are lazy to take care of themselves. So when they see a man who's attractive, they know you are holding up on your looks. They know you're in the gym. They know you probably grind on your grind. This is why they will try to make guard you from other women because you are a specimen. You are a man that came into their life that they won't see on a daily basis. So they will try their hardest to keep you. You will be on their mind 24 seven, especially if you laid it down on them. This is why you can't even just give pipe. You can't give good pipe to every female because it will almost be annoying the way they will be blowing up your phone when you are a handsome man that laid it down on them, bro. It will be annoying the way they will blow your phone up when you laid it down on them and you are a man that looks good. And trust me, they will tell their friends and even some of their friends will be interested in you. They'll be like, shoot, I wanna know what that be like. If you that guy, bro, you will have the ability to even pull their friends. I've even had one instance where I was talking to this one girl. Now it wasn't that serious, but her, her friend literally hit me up and we literally made it happen. You feel me? We got to doing stuff because the other girl was playing around. But if that girl is talking to her friends about you, they wanna see what that experience is like. They will be intrigued when they hear everything this girl is saying about you to them. It's just toxic advice. But trust me, that's just how it goes, bro. See, as a handsome man, it will come with highs and lows with some of these women out here. But the best thing you can do, make best with what you got. Get in the gym. Take care of your skin. Find that confidence within yourself. And trust me, the rules do not apply to a man who these women are truly attracted to. All this advice that you see out here is different for every man. When you're really a blessed man out there, bro, trust me, it will not be hard out here with these females. Keep taking care of yourself, RBO.